the world's ugliest website. Sorry, Simon. Simon Willison calls it a weblog. The origin of the word blog is a web weblog or a blog. SimonWillison.net is probably one of the best resources for high-level thinking about artificial intelligence. Incredibly smart guy, and he writes this weblog. The site is basic and ugly kind of flexing because he's just so knowledgeable and he can write so well so i highly recommend you check out this blog i wanted to highlight this article which came out yesterday about agents because there is a lot of confusion about what an agent is that confusion is perpetuated by marketing companies call their ai tools agents when they are not so there's a huge amount of confusion in public about what an agent is and that means lots of things get overblown lots of people things got oversold this is all possible because there is not an agreed upon definition of agent simon willison says agent may finally have a widely enough agreed definition to be useful jargon now over the past few weeks i've started using the word agent in conversations where i don't feel the need to then define it roll my eyes or wrap it in scare quotes you might see me do this a lot where i'm like agent we're getting to the point where we might not need to do that because we're starting to land on a definition. Simon says, this is a big piece of personal development for me. Moving forward, when I talk about agents, I'm going to use this. So here's the definition. An LLM agent runs tools in a loop to achieve a goal. In a loop is important. An LLM agent runs tools in a loop to achieve a goal. I've been hesitant to use the term agent for meaningful communication over the past couple of years. It felt like a buzzword bingo. Everyone talked about agents, but everyone seemed to hold a different mental model. The vagueness allowed marketing hype because nobody had a good definition. Otherwise, we could point at a product and say, well, that's not an agent. But we haven't been able to because we haven't had a general definition. So Simon actually, he started collecting definitions. Crowdsourced 211 on Twitter which he then took over to AI and he managed to summarize them into 13 groups inside of Gemini. There's a lot of noise. Jargon terms are only useful if people share the same definition. If they don't, the communication becomes less effective. You waste time discussing entirely different concepts. That is Reddit, AI red subreddits in a nutshell, is people arguing back and forward, back and forward. But most of the time it's because they are not using the same definitions, including terms like artificial intelligence.